Well, praise the Lord. Great to be with you. God bless you, each and every one. Father, help us to be strong in you that we be worthy to escape the wrath of the Lamb. Jesus, rapture, Nibiru, and the wrath. That's the topic today. Uh, when shall be the calling away of the very elect? Uh, <clears throat> I'm going to try to uh, explain this to you as, as best I can. And I hope I didn't leave anything out, but I may have, if I did, uh, make a comment. So uh, <clears throat> in Mark uh, 13, 26, And then shall they see the Son of Man coming in the clouds with great power and glory. Now, according to the word of God, uh, not all will uh, be raptured uh, before the wrath of, of the Lamb. For out of the seven churches, only one was told that they would be not be uh, put through the, uh, the temptations which will come upon the whole world. Uh, so are you uh, really ready? Are you really ready? Ask yourself that. Seek the Lord about it. For if you are, uh, if you are, uh, you will see the wrath of, of the Lamb come upon the whole world. Uh, but uh, from heaven shall you shall you be watching it. Now, uh, now, uh, now, what is the sign of His coming? Because He gave us a sign of His coming in the clouds uh, uh, to call His elect home. In in uh, Matthew uh, twenty four thirty. And then shall appear a sign of the Son of Man in heaven, and then shall all the tribes of the of the earth mourn, and they shall uh, see the Son of Man coming in the clouds of heaven with power and great glory. The sign of the Lord is uh, is the virgin birth in heaven. Uh, one could say uh, this sign was uh, it was with when Mary gave uh, birth to to Christ. For there was a was a star in heaven uh, which was seen over his birth, and uh, which uh, also guided the three wise kings to him. But what uh, then is the sign which depicts the birth? For even uh, then was a star seen. Uh, this is Nibiru, a dwarf star, and it and it flew as it flew by Earth. Isn't the Lord amazing that uh, even the stars in heaven uh, obey His will? But yet, uh, but this was uh, only His first uh, first coming as a man uh, to redeem all flesh uh, that that all can walk in newness of life. But we are are born of water uh, when we are born of water, uh, baptized in Jesus' name. That's when we walk in newness of life. But what uh, what about his second coming? Uh, for when uh, when he returns, he will uh, to earth uh, for the second time. It is uh, to uh, lock up Satan uh, for a thousand years. At this time, uh, he sets up a millennial reign on earth. At the end of the tribulation uh, is the first resurrection. In Revelation 24, and I saw a throne. And uh, they that sat uh, sat upon them, there were many, and judgment was given unto them. And I saw the uh, the souls of them that were beheaded for the witness of Jesus, and for the word of God, and uh, which had no, not worshipped the beast, neither his uh, image, neither had received his mark upon their foreheads, or in their hands, and they lived and reigned with Christ for a thousand years. Now that's who lives and reigns that, uh, that thousand years with Christ here on earth. It's not the raptured saints. <clears throat> we come back and liberate the world so that he can. In Revelation 25, But the rest of the dead lived not again until the uh, thousand years were finished. This is the first resurrection. There are those uh, killed by the sword uh, for, for the sake. These are those who were killed by the sword for the sake of Christ. Before and after uh, tribulation. Also are, uh, are the babies slain in, uh, uh, in one form or another. Abortion or whatever. Will also be uh, resurrected and, and, 
and life and live during uh, the millennial reign of, of Christ on earth. Yet none of this is, uh, is the rapture of the very elect of God's saints, which will, will be, uh, which will already be in heaven waiting for the end of the seven years, uh, great tribulation. Now when he, uh, when he comes in the clouds, uh, he will be with ten thousands of his angels. Yet at the end of the tribulation, he returns with ten thousands of his saints. In Jude uh, 14, uh, and Enoch also, uh, the seventh from Adam, prophesied of, of these things, saying, Behold, the Lord cometh uh, with ten thousands of his saints. You see, we're more powerful than the angels. We must be uh, in heaven already to testify of these things. Uh, so what then is, is the great sign in heaven but, uh, but the virgin birth? In Revelation 12, 1, And uh, there appeared a great wonder in heaven, a woman clothed with the sun, and the moon at her, at her feet, and upon her head a crown of twelve stars. Now I have uh, shown you this uh, several in, in several videos, but I will uh, show it again uh, in this one. And uh, and she and she being with uh, with child uh, cried travailing in birth and pain to be delivered. This is the, the planet Jupiter, uh, which aligns with Mars, and, and the, the sun will be at her head over here, and it, it'll clothe her because of the shining of, the, of it, and the 12 stars. Uh, uh, this is the planet J uh, Jupiter, which, uh, which will cross the path of the, of, the, of the birth canal of the celestial woman. And there appeared another wonder in heaven, and behold, a red dragon, having seven heads and ten horns and, and seven crowns upon his head. Now that's the beast of Revelation. Now this uh, uh, depicts the Nibiru sun, which is, will, will also cross at the same time uh, the birth canal of the woman in, in the stars. For it is, uh, it has a a million or so miles of red, uh, red iron and rubble uh, debris tra uh, trailing it, looking like a red dragon. Also, as uh, as above, so shall uh, below. It speaks of uh, of seven heads, ten horns, and seven crowns. Uh, this is the beast of, of a revelation making its appearance at the, at the calling away of the saints, which are holding it back now. For that uh, which restrains uh, must be taken out of the way for Satan to take over. You will notice uh, also that the, that the tail of the, of the dragon, which is depicted in heaven, which is Satan uh, also pulling a third uh, of the stars uh, to earth. Uh, <clears throat> and his tail drew a third part of the stars uh, of heaven and did cast them uh, to earth. And the dragon stood before the woman, which was ready to be delivered for, uh, for to devour her child as soon as uh, it was born. And that is, these are, I don't know if you call them metaphors or what they are, but... Uh, <clears throat> This is the appearance of Satan and the third part of the hosts of heaven. And she brought forth a man-child who was to rule all nations uh, with a rod of iron. And her child uh, was caught up unto God and, and to, the, to his throne. That would be the elect, the, the saints of God. That's the rapture. This is where you will, uh, where the very elect will be raptured and caught up to God uh, and his throne. This is the rapture of the church, uh, which many speak of, but some do not believe in. Even the experts uh, do not know the day or the hour, uh, as the Lord has told us. However, as knowledge is increased and God sends word to his people, uh, the mysteries of God are revealed to us. 
the timing of his uh, heavenly uh, of this heavenly sign uh, in heaven uh, is September 9th and uh, through the uh, September 23rd in that range of 2017. If this is the is if this is the time frame of the Lord, uh, which very well could be, because uh, that's when the Virgin and Jupiter comes across the the canal, the birth canal uh, for the sign, and that's when Nibiru will cross also. Uh, for these signs are given uh, that we may know it is not just by and by. Uh, <clears throat> should you not begin uh, to seek the Lord uh, with all your heart? And mind and soul, for this is uh, what what a bride does when uh, when she truly loves her husband. Are you ready for the great uh, and awesome day of the Lord? For at the same time, uh, will also will His wrath be poured out uh, on the on the wicked? Come, let us call out to the Lord uh, that we uh, be ready in Jesus' name. Now I don't know how else to put this to you. Time is growing very short, and uh, uh, you'll look up from time to time, and if you really look in the sky, you will see the two suns. They're there. They are there, and I've shown them before and, uh, in many videos, and they're, 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 even uh, the Weather Channel has a depiction where they showed on one end of the street uh, uh, sun setting, and on the other end of the street, uh, on the complete opposite, 180 degrees that way, there's another sun. both setting and horizon. So <clears throat> let us come to the Lord now, because time is short. He's warned and warned and warned and warned, and I've warned and warned and warned and warned. Many people have warned, but are you taking heed? And I pray that you are, and I pray that you're trying to, you're praying uh, for your for your children to come into to, to Christ. So let us pray. Take all of our needs to the Lord. La conde hela o shakut kat conde tebi kulati. Kunga kunga kasanda bakuli kandur ki kasya kotokati. La conde la baku shaku kaski konda kuduri bakat kata. Konda la kasya kote tu kuta baku kiki kiki. Konda la baku sherabeti. In Jesus name. Now, if you prayed and you did not doubt, you will receive what you asked for. Now, Jesus loves you, and I love you. Now, you stay blessed. Until next time, in Jesus' holy name, amen.